All right, let's start the review. Green Mountain Coffee, this company started out in Vermont. They started out with K-Cop and all that. A lot of it was distributed among skiing lodges. So, one of my favorite cups, Pink Floyd Animals. We're going to pour that in. And uh, of course, I use a little bit of milk. Sorry, I didn't put the time on there. Let's pause this for a And splish splash. My coffee was taking a milk bath. All right, so you. I drink coffee all day long, by the way. A very long day for the pepper company, pepper seed company. So here we go. No sugar added. Instant, there is a caramel flavor. There's a sweetness caramel. It's quality coffee. The flavoring, 1 out of 10. Let's just go for the gut instinct, 7.4. The coffee beans, and uh, being you know, 10 being the best. I'm giving it a solid, solid 7. So, it's really... This is really about a C average. It's good. It's passable. Now, keep in mind, flavored coffee is always better with a little bit of sugar. Uh, seems like uh, there's a little bit of bitterness in flavored coffee. A little bit of sugar goes a long way. You know what? I got some sugar. Let's, uh, let's step it up a notch. If, uh, I, I, uh, big notch. I put too, way too much sugar in there. A huge clump of it. That's why you should always use a spoon. All right. Okay, there we go. When you add sugar, we're going to 8.1 with flavor. I like it. Flavoring coffee, I always do say, hey, add a little bit of sugar. goes a long way. I prefer fair trade beans, and I'll get more into that with the reviews. All right. Much love, everybody. Drink coffee. Have a happy, healthy life and productive. Drink more coffee.